Hey guys, my name is Dee and today we will be talking about year 22 in Acts 18, 9 through 17. So Paul is in Corinth right now and he has this vision from God that says like, do not be afraid, do not be silent, speak. And that he has many people in this city. Um, and so in the middle of all this, Gallio is the head of the preconsul, and the Jews come to Gallio complaining about Paul and saying, like, this guy, he is persuading the people to worship a God that's, like, contrary to the law. But literally, as soon as Paul is about to, like, speak and defend himself, Gallio's like, no, he has not committed a crime, he has not done any wrongdoing, like, I will not accept your complaint from, to, from the Jews. And so I feel like that is basically God fulfilling his word and that he gave uh, Paul in the vision that to speak, to continue and uh, keep preaching the gospel. Like he does not have to be afraid. And so I just want to encourage you guys that in your life, if you are afraid of talking about Jesus and preaching the good news, like do not be afraid because God is protecting you. And even if people don't receive it well the first time, his word is alive. And, and God's going to do what he's going to do. And so I just feel like it's our job, not even our job, it's just our calling to preach the gospel, to the good news. And so do not be afraid. So let's pray. Lord, we just thank you, thank you, thank you so much for your good news, for the sacrifice that you made for us, and for just the renewing that you have done in our life and I just pray that you give us the boldness and the courage to not be afraid to preach your word to preach the good news and so God just give us a spirit not of fear but of sound mind and that you just give us the courage to preach so thank you Lord in the name of Jesus we pray amen